Yo 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 what is up guys? Yo 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 what is up guys? My yo 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 what is up guys? My name is Astro Phoenix and today it is the 14th of August 2019 which means it's my one year on testosterone video. Well, yeah, one year on testosterone. Period. <laughs> and um yeah, I guess the first thing I'm going to say right now is um disclaimer. My voice is only low right now because it's like I've just woke up not long ago. And, uh, my voice is always low in the morning, and I'm sure everyone's is, so there you go. Um, my voice isn't, like, my voice hasn't really changed that much over the last year. I've been, I'm on, a, like, a kind of low dose of testosterone. And, um, I've been on 0 0.4 milliliters, and then a few months ago I moved up to 0 0.6 and the full one is one whole milliliter, so I'm, I'm only just about halfway, or just over halfway, I mean, um, to the full dose. So that's kind of shit, <laughs> but um, it's, a, it's a wild ride. Um, things are happening really slowly. Uh, I'll, I'll show you, wait. Here's Kieran. <laughs> Um, I just want to say that I have more leg hair than I used to. This is a really odd thing to be showing zoomed in. I'm sorry. Um, and I never used to have any leg hair, like, whatsoever. And, but, like, now... It's, like... It's, it's, it's there. And it's starting to grow up here more. Like, I'm getting blonde hairs around here. Which is crazy, because I've honestly never had leg hair before, like, it was nothing, and now I can actually see what's growing, which is insane. I know it's been a year, and I should probably have more, but this is, uh, this is the extent of what I've got after a year on a lower dose, and, you know, everyone's different, I guess. Okay, it's been long enough since I last recorded a little bit for the video. Um, you can probably, like, hear the difference in my voice, because it's warmed up now, it's not as deep. So this is how I sound every day, and this is something I'm kind of a little bit insecure about, because people still kind of think to themselves, like, mm, girl or boy, confusing. Like, because I say, oh yeah, I'm 17, well, I'm going to be 18 next week. Um, yeah, I'm 17. They're like, okay, small, very small, very small. You're going to get taller. I'm like, mm, I have stunted growth, but... <laughs> No one ever believes me when I say I have stunted growth. They're gonna they always say like, "Oh, don't worry, you're gonna get taller. Your voice is gonna get deeper." Um, yeah, and I'm just like, no, no, it's um, I'm not gonna get taller. My voice is probably gonna get deeper. I mean, it will. I hope, but um, yeah. On the topic of people talking to me and not understanding my gender, um, thinking that maybe I'm a girl. Um, I had my hair longer for the last, well, I, I was growing it for the last eight months, maybe, and I just got my hair cut a few days ago, and, uh, I haven't, I, I got a new job, and I think it really, it really pushed me to get my hair cut when, um, when the customers coming in were like, oh, uh, talking to the kids, or talking to people they're with, or just whatever, and they're saying, oh, give, th give this to, to the young lady, or, or like, oh, mm, say thank you to the young lady, or something, and I'm like, what the fuck do I look like to you? <laughs> I don't know. Um, so yeah, that, that's, uh, that's something that, that kind of negatively affected me. I, like, I enjoy my job, but that was like, mm, yeah, I've got to get my hair cut, um, because I haven't had enough changes to pass with longer hair yet, um, so, mm. On the upside, though, um, since starting testosterone, I've been a lot more confident and outgoing, and I've just felt a lot better in myself, um, I've been happier, um, I mean, I guess this is a positive and a negative in some respects, but I've been unable to cry as much. I've cried a few times because of some pretty um, heavy stuff that's happened, but 
other than that, like, I can't cry over the things that I used to be able to just c kind of cry about casually, like, and I'm, I'm okay with that, I'm okay with that, with that, because it's not like, I'm not getting super depressed because I can't do it, I'm fine, I guess, um, like, I go through my ups and downs still, of course, but, you know, not being able to cry is, is pretty good in some circumstances, like, Sometimes it's like it, it really helps in social situations to not like burst out in tears because of something that's happened. So yeah. Also, I don't know if I've talked about this in a YouTube video before, but I dropped out of college twice. Uh, the first time I went to a college in a nearby town where my, I guess you could call them classmates, um, they kind of always, like, questioned, I, I was only there for, like, three weeks, by the way, they questioned my gender, they were, like, they, they were always calling me, like, she, or, like, oh, are you a girl or a boy, or, oh, you're really small for a boy, I'm, like, I don't know, I, I couldn't deal with it. it, it was too much, like, within the first few weeks of college, and, and I didn't enjoy the classes anyway, my teachers were hard work, everyone in the classes were hard work, and the stuff that I thought I was going to be doing wasn't quite what we were actually doing, and it was very overwhelming to do stuff that didn't make sense to me and I didn't enjoy, and I didn't want to sit there and do that for a whole year or two years, I'm not, I don't even remember how long the courses were. So yeah, that was the first year, that was... September 2017, and then September 2018, I was supposed to be going to a college to study um, animal management, but that quickly went downhill when the bursary forms didn't go through, they lost the shit, um, <laughs> and and Joey, who you've seen in previous videos, he, um, he went and didn't enjoy it, apparently, well, I won't go into details, but it just wasn't, it wasn't a good course. Um, for him, and hearing that means it probably wouldn't have been a good course for me, um, but I couldn't even go anyway because the bursary forms didn't go through, and that was a piss take. Um, so this year I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to college to study art and design level three, which is something that I think I'll really get along with because art and design was like my main subject in school, and it, it's going to be something that I'm passionate about. I'm more passionate about digital art right now, which is uh, a fact that I'm going to have to get around because this is going to be like traditional art based. And by traditional, I mean pencil, paper, uh, paints, stuff like that. I don't mean like traditional as in any other way. I mean, it's not digital um, <clears throat> and it's not cartoony. So that's going to be something that I'm going to have to work around mentally, because <laughs> I'm used to doing digital art, as you can see if you watch my videos. Um, so yeah, but I think it's going to be fun, I think it's going to be fun. Apart from the summer homework right now, the summer homework is to um, uh, do some shit on, uh, on a drawer in the room. Uh, but I decided that instead of doing my homework on my drawers, I'm going to do it on my shelf, because my shelf has more interesting stuff that I can talk about and be creative about, like my games a few figures, um, and I can open up boxes, and there are train tickets, um, and cards, and, yeah, um, and, and, uh, carving knives and stuff, because I do DIY shit, and, and fursuits, I guess, don't quote me on that, I don't really want to make more fursuits ever, but, <laughs> um, yeah, I've been, I've been, like, rambling on for a long time, um, I should be uploading a video, um, soon about, um, well not about, but I should be uploading a video also today or tomorrow of pi a picture timeline of me from day one on testosterone to today, and that's gonna be 365 photos kind of time-lapsed. I've seen other people do it before, and it turned out really well. I've already, like, kind of seen what mine is gonna be like, and it's, it's weird, I'm, I'm the man of a million haircuts, basically, although I've only had, like, two haircuts since starting two, or three, 
Like, my hair just looks different every day, and I mean that in a bad way, it looks terrible. Um, so, yeah, I'll look forward to that. Also, here's the boy. The boy. Kieran. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, um, <laughs> I, I think I'll leave that off here, and, um, I'm, I've probably missed stuff that I can't really think about right now. Oh, yeah, I'm, I've been referred to, um, I've been referred to an adult gender clinic, so I will be going to that next month, um, September 27th, um, so that's gonna be good, um, we'll see what happens then, I might make a vlog about what happened at the appointment, but also maybe not, anyway, yeah, um, I guess, uh, I'll, I'll see, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Goodbye.